Women, yeah, I I love my women and I I respect them, but it's it right now it's like as day goes by every single day, something happens, and uh, it's like their value keep dropping the more and more and more. Well, I love my women, I respect them, but I'm telling you that over the years men have not really changed, and men will never change. Men will always be men. Women will always, women just want to evolve like the man and measure up with the man. And uh, as it goes like that, they always get it the wrong way. Well, before I start this video, I would like you to like, share and subscribe and let's get to it. What am I talking about? I'm talking about, about our women nowadays. If you look at your mother, if you look at her, how she grew up, yes a lot of our mothers did not marry who they love they were either picked or it is what it was out of necessity but uh, people now think that you must marry who you love or you must be a uh, hundred percent in love to get married mind you love is good love is nice the love is beautiful but you will also understand that the life of a man and the life of a woman is not the same a woman is all about time it's all about egg it's all about use it's all about fertility it's all about usage and it's all about what a man can get out of you and if you're a woman that you think the same way like a man thinks that then you are making a very big mistake if you listen to feminists and they tell you that a woman can do what a man can do even better yes but a man can do more even when he's getting old men appreciate with age i'm sorry to say it yes but what the value of a woman is all about that her prime age what she can give and what she can get out of it but right now it's all about everybody's looking like everybody's looking like i want to secure the bag with any any or every man that is available example in my country right now it's all about when you see a lady that uh, is working right now and you talk to the lady your friends might say oh she's beautiful but she don't burn no she don't burn two she don't burn four she don't burn three she don't burn one a lot of people got something to say about the fact that i got six kids with six different men so i'm just gonna tell y'all why mm, okay it is better to do it this way if i had six kids wow. with all the same all right. dude i get 34 percent of his income which is only 680 okay. a month she breaking it down if I got six kids with six different dudes, I get 17%. All right, all right, here we go. From each one of them, which is 340 a month from each one. Okay. $340 a month times six baby daddies is 2040 So why don't you have six baby daddies? Beautiful young ladies. And I'm telling you that this is just a way just to make sure that they keep eating and they keep living the life they want. Nobody is committing to anybody because they can't afford to commit because they were not taught to be a wife. Most of our ladies are now being taught just to be single and independent. None of them are taught how to be a, ma a, a man's wife. They are just taught how to make money, be single, be independent and be a superwoman and a powerwoman and a boss lady. But when it comes to being a wife, zero. They believe that they believe that when you have that uh, your husband he's rich you can get anybody from your village to clean the house and cook food for you you will just be the housewife doing all the knocking and just that mind you most african men don't even appreciate that because they will love their wife to cook for them and the ability for you to cook for your husband and sit him that if your husband can remember your food and want to go home and eat it then you have a power over him but if your husband remembers your cooking and said man i'm skipping then you have a problem it's not all about sex your husband can get sex anywhere your husband can your man can get it from anywhere but if you know how to put it down as a wife thank you very much 
now ladies don't even want to be that wife again ladies want to be measured with the wife ladies know that they don't even have what it takes to be a wife they don't even know what they don't even have what it takes to just be a man's wife or maintain that wife that is why when you go to the city when men comes to marry they will always say that the wife are scarce but women don't even understand that they will say what do you mean wife are scarce there are women everywhere no there are qualities we men want in women listen men if you start talking to a girl and all of a sudden she has family issues all of a sudden she needs help she needs assistance she needs a favor just stop just stop just run even if she's scaly even if she has big boobs and soft ass or whatnot just stop you see you might be beautiful you might be hardworking. you might be all those things but you are never submissive you are not a wife material it's not about you get sense you get in you get it's not about all those things these are the qualities of a of a fun girl you are good for fun but you can't be good as a wife remember it used to be like when a guy goes to school gets work and when the guy is ready to marry he will get a wife from the village it is called a trophy wife your wife from the village can cook clean and she is not used just the way the city girls are used nobody knows who she is and she is submissive to the husband right now the trophy wife are no longer there because everybody's now opened their eyes nobody knows how to cook nobody knows how to clean nobody knows how to be a wife everybody goes to youtube to find how to cook everybody goes online to measure their lifestyle but you want to get the treatment of a wife so your you, the plan is that if i can't be a wife i can at least have a baby for four or five different men and then they will pay my my children's school fees on all those things if that is your plan my sister then you have a big problem yes you seriously have a big problem because if you think that having more babies and taking more money from men because you have their baby is the way to survive your your children will grow up and look at you and look at you and say well well once upon a time my mother was for the street because that's that is the blueprint of your whole thing being a wife it's more important than a work than working for a man eight to twelve hours in the office but being a wife and staying at your in your house working cooking for your husband making the house clean is more it's more like a slave work now nobody wants to do it but you want to go to the office and work five six seven ten hours a day then you come back and you look at your husband like then let's who we cook who we clean i'm telling you ladies it is now more difficult to find a wife I don't care how in love you are. I don't care how beautiful you are. When that man wants to get married, he will look at your face and say, mm, I'll pass. But he, because he knows that you can't do what he wants in a woman. Why not change? Thanks for listening. Please like, share and subscribe.